15 for two. Do you pay attention to the kind of underwear that you put on your body or you just purchase anything that looks nice for you and you put it on? Let me know in the comment section because you are going to find out that the type of underwear or the material of your underwear really matters. Knowing the material that is perfect for your body when it comes to underwears will save you a lot of trouble and will keep your skin very safe and comfortable especially our private skin so let's dive into this video i hope you enjoy like share and let me know where you're watching from i always want to know where my youtube farm is best because you all are don't just uh followers or subscribers you are my family thank you for being here it means so much to me Fifteen for two. Looking at these inputs, I'm thinking, no, this should be like three RMBs. That is like zero point zero zero one dollars. <laughs> I don't mean to sound mean, but I guess I was not the target customer for these inputs because, trust me, I cannot buy those for for seven RMBs. <laughs> i walked through this tunnel wondering where are the night wears or inputs for the body's art because everything i was seeing was like what's this <laughs> while i'm supposed to show you everything that i see in the market because i know that there are so many people that would be interested in different products please accept my personal opinions of some on some of the products that i see because sometimes they surprise me too i'm like okay i wouldn't wear this even if it was given to me for free <laughs> Everything they get no fasting. I don't care what you knew me in the past tense. I ain't no dreamy style, this ain't no last dance. We pass it. What? Now, these are nice, they were so seamless. The, the material was good, they felt like they would be comfortable even if it's summer. That is exactly what I'm always looking for when I go to a market. I want to find good quality products that I can use. Or also think that the people that watch my videos can also use. What do you all think? I would buy those for 99. Three pieces at 99, that's a fair price because uh, their material is actually good. Men in the comment section, please help me. Are you all still wearing these boxers? And at what occasions do you wear them? <laughs> I don't know if you all can tell from the video that these pajamas have some really good quality. Their cotton feels good. It feels like actual cotton and they are worth that price actually. 69 RMBs. I would definitely buy these Timos 10. They really feel good and they, they have good designs as well. Yeah, if you come to this market, you could find that supplier. I really don't remember the shop number. But their pajamas were really nice. Mm -hmm. 
The one major good thing I noticed about this market is that most of the products are made of cotton. They are soft and they feel like they are they are okay for underwears because you know if you're buying an underwear, it's better you get something that is 100% cotton and the, the material is very good because an underwear gets it touches your skin like directly. So you need to get something that has a material that will not affect your skin and for the ladies, you understand what I mean mostly. So this is a very good advantage for this market because most of the underwears, the lingerie, and uh, most of the things that I touched were cotton, except these boxers. <laughs> That's why I kept touching them. I was wondering, which material is this? Someone help me in the comment section. When choosing a woman underwear, I would suggest that one goes more for something that is cotton because the cotton material is not just gentle but it is also hypoallergenic that makes it so ideal for people that have allergies and very sensitive skin plus also there is a way the cotton material is so soft and it is so breathable which can help to prevent yeast infections. You do not want to wear a nika that itself can cause you uncomfortability or give you an infection. And that is all, oh, oh my good. So cotton is the best way to go for women. For men, I think you can go in between cotton and polyester. However, I feel like polyester is a better option. First of all, it's so easy to wash. Like if there is any stain, you can easily wash it. It dries so quick and it doesn't wrinkle. So there are no chances of it getting stuck in a very sensitive part of a man's body. That would be very, very bad. However, we cannot deny the fact that cotton is very, very breathable and very comfortable. And for people that are that sweat way too much, cotton would be the best option. So it's better you try both of them and see which works best for you, especially during summer. You really need to choose your undies very carefully. Otherwise, a wrong undie can also lead to a very bad body odor. If it accumulates the sweat and then you're running up and down and everything is going on, plus if maybe the cotton is stuck on some part of your body, oh my goodness, it is very important to be keen when you're choosing 
which underwear is perfect for your body. When choosing underwears for kids, be it boys or girls, make sure that you choose something cotton, 100% cotton. Because baby skins are actually more sensitive than ours, also they get irritated so quickly. I cannot imagine your little toddler crying, but because of a very uncomfortable underwear or attire, any kind of cloth that you put on them, and they cannot communicate that it's the cloth making them uncomfortable so please just go for anything cotton everything cotton when it comes to especially babies like i said as you can see there this is called the first tunnel it is a tunnel next to guanju south railway station i do not know how to direct you there now if i see one of you in the comment section asking me how do we get there what is the name of this market i'm going to be really really unhappy thank you for watching please subscribe like and share this video see you in my next video bye